Hi everyone! Welcome back to Wonder Snatch, and today we're going all pink. Um, I hope everyone's staying well and healthy during these times. And let's go from this to this. If you want to see how I turn into this boudoir beauty, like, subscribe, ring the bell, and I'll see you in a bit. Okay, I've brought you in, done my eyebrows and put on my face tapes and today we're going in with, I think, skin first and because we're doing all pink, I'm going to go in with some pink creams as well and I've got this Mehron cream stick in pink. I'm going to go for a very sultry bedroom look, so let's get started. I've powdered my brows and I've primed my face with this uh, Tatcha primer and I'm going to go in with my Kryolan paint sticks. First with the lighter colour 2W to cover the brows. and 070 white to do my highlight and 5W just to go on the outside and taking a dampened beauty blender I'm going to start blending from the inside out so how is everyone doing during this lockdown time, partial lockdown I hope everyone's doing well, staying at home. Try not to socialize. Best time to start a YouTube channel. Into the eyebrow. It's just light bouncing motions. Out into the proof. And now back with the contour with B21, a nice dark shade. Contouring as I usually do. I'm going to keep things a bit further up here today. Instead of dragging it all the way down like it usually do. So I just turned this around to use a clean side and just to bounce it down. All right. Then just go back to the dirty side to control this arch here to make the forehead look so tiny. And now back with this Morphe brush onto the nose. Pinch this. Give him a bit more. Skinny nose now. And today, for concealer, I'm going to do a Tarte Shape Tape. Just conceal a little bit more. Brand new beauty sponge, just for this. And also, I want to highlight just under the cheek. And now, as promised, I'm going to go in with my pink Maron paint stick to sketch out the eyebrow. Today, the eyebrow is going to be a Violet Chachki-esque, very thin arch. Start where your normal eyebrow starts and go. And I'm also going to use this as a blush starter. I'm going to clean up that brow with a little bit more white. And now to set with powders. First, my Ben Nye Super White to so all the highlighted areas. You really want to get the, these areas that crease very easily first. And translucent powder, Cody Air Spun, to the rest of the face. Apparently this powder is, reminds a lot of people of their grandmas. It does have this very grandma kind of scent. Make sure to 
we got that sweaty nose. And now we bake. And now before I go into the eyes, I'm going to knock off some of that translucent powder with my contour. And I'm using the NYX palette today. Starting with this darker cool colour. That's my contour. And I'm going to contour my nose with a much skinnier brush today. And this is by LA Colours. And it's a nice skinny brush. And I'm going to mix the same colour this one, but with a little bit of the brown. A little bit of this warmer tan. Go down the nose. Connect that to the beginning of the brown. And now, today, for something different, I'm going to go with a liner first, just like how Violet Chachki does hers. I've got a whole bunch of liners here that I've never used. They're by NYX and I just found them at the bottom of the drawer, so let's try doing that today. First with this super skinny eye marker, and I'm going to draw the wing really far out, okay? I'm going to go in from the corner of my eye to probably about there. Okay, and how she does hers is that she usually covers her entire eyelid with black, so that's what I'm going to do too. See what I mean? Because of my brow bone there, there's always this little bit of a skip. Let's make that, maybe it doesn't make it bigger. Using the liquid liner, I'm going to fill that in. So that's a little messy, so I'm going to clean that up and do the same on the other side. And now using the James Charles palette, I'm going to use black to set that. Okay, now I've got my face tapes on and you can see how much more snatched I look now. I'm using a small little Morphe brush and the pink in the James Charles palette just to sketch out my crease. Okay, and I'm going to start somewhere here, right above my normal crease. And then just to meet up with the eyebrow. Same on the other side. And now that that's sketched out, I'm going to blend it out with a bit of this, the same pink, but with this lighter shade here as well. And now using the Holiday Palette by Morphe, I'm going to take this darker pink here, okay, to, to intensify the crease. And I'm going to start on the outside. And going back with the fluffier brush, blend that out. And now with my angled brush, my MAC angled brush, I'm going to go in with, I'm going to intensify the brows again with that same pink from the James Charles Palette. And then going back in with Neron White to intensify the brow. And this time, I'm going to set that with Sugar Pill Diamond Eye. So it's a bit of a very bright, shimmery white. I'm going to trace under the pink. using some black. And blend that out. And now that that's all blended out, I'm going to go in with my P. Louise to cut the crease. And I'm using white. Back of the hand.
And now on the eyelid, I'm gonna go in with some shimmer. Max Fix Plus. And using this pink shimmer from the Morphe palette. Um, this other Morphe palette. I've got so many Morphe palettes. I know they're problematic, but it's so affordable and uh, easy to use. That needs your finger. And now I'm going to top off that inner corner with this Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow by Stila. And I've used the Kimchi palette, Watermelon, the pink, to really, as blush, to really make it very pink and rosy. Okay, and I brought it up into the hairline as well. For lips, I'm going to use the Jeffree Star Prom Night, really, really hot pink. And I'm going to keep with the Violet Chachki theme of making the lips really small and pouty. And now I'm going to use my angled brush to darken up the edges with some pink eyeshadow from the Kimchi palette. And I'm using the Coloured Rain Gloss, as I did for my Violet look. Give it a nice iridescent sheen. And setting spray. And I'm going to highlight with my BH Cosmetics Black Light Palette. It's pink. Alright, I'm going to put on some lashes and get dressed and I'll see you soon. Now I've got my wig on, my lashes on. Today I used 301s, which are much bigger than I usually like because but I think the dramatic eye look calls for it. Got some nails on, I'm gonna put my thumbs in and then I'm gonna take some pictures for the Instagram. So I'll see you there and I'll see you next time. Stay safe, stay home, and stay snatched. Bye!